Welcome back to Just Scribble. Recently, Avant Agenda offered some surprise boxes on their website where you spent $25 and you got a box that had over $50 worth of product in it. So I decided that I would snag one of their surprise boxes in the classic happy planner size, since that is one of the planner sizes that they offer that I use most often in my lineup. And then I also ordered a few items from their shop. I got my box, so I thought we would open it up and check it out. Try to find some scissors. So if you guys aren't aware, I am a PR team member for Avant Agenda for the fall. So I do currently have a discount code to shop their site and save 10%. So I'll put a link to that down below in the description box so you guys can shop their site with my code. One of the awesome things about being on the PR team and being able to offer this discount code is that it is available for subscription boxes too. So it's not just available for items that you can buy in their shop regularly. You can actually save 10% on their subscription box, which is amazing. So I wanted to definitely tell you guys that so you guys knew about saving a little bit of money and shopping their amazing shop. So I did add a little piece of washi here to cover up a discount code that came on the thank you for the purchase. So this card is just a little thank you for the purchase and it gives their Instagram handle, which I'll put right here down below, and also the hashtag to use when you are sharing their items so that they can check them out as well. And on the back, it has this beautiful picture of some pens. This paper feels really nice. It has sort of a linen finish. I don't know if you guys can see that on film, but it's really, really nice. So I'm going to slip this out. This black bag it should be my order that I ordered from their web shop, and then this should be my surprise box. So let's do the order from the web shop first, and then we will do the surprise box just because I'm gonna run out of room on my table otherwise. So it did come with this beautiful card, also with a gorgeous linen finish. This is a thick business card, this is nice. And it has their name and their logo on that side. And then on the other side, it talks about their monthly subscription box. So you can check that out. I do have unboxings of my subscription box and I will have unboxings of my future boxes. So you can definitely check those out as well. I will put links in the cards up above to the ones that I've already unboxed and then definitely subscribe so you don't miss future unboxings as well. Especially because sometimes I do offer some of the items from my sub box to my subscribers and I also do giveaways sometimes with contents with contents from my sub boxes. So definitely make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss out on freebies and giveaways as well. We are going to open this up and check out my order. So this is a part of my web shop order. Actually, the other part is underneath in the box because it didn't fit in the little black bag. So we're gonna open this part first. So the first thing that I actually ordered were some pens. They have some amazing pens on their website and they also have a pen subscription box, which I have subscribed to. So now you will see an unboxing of one in the future on my channel, but I love pens. I am definitely a pen addict and I am really excited about that subscription box, but I did snag from their site three different pens. So I got this Kokio Me pen. I love these pens so much. I have them in every single color and I actually snagged this one because I'm gonna be including it in a future giveaway that I'm gonna be doing on my channel in the fall. So this Kokio pen in the charcoal gray is actually gonna be in a giveaway in the fall. And then I snagged two of the Kokio Platinum collab fountain pens. This is a platinum preppy that was a collab with Kokio. And so they have this beautiful white barrel. It comes with fountain pen ink. And then it has the fountain pen nib. Let me screw this back on so you can check it out. The platinum preppies are a great starter pen or just a nice fountain pen to toss into your bag. Platinum is one of my favorite fountain pen brands and I have been eyeing this collab pen for quite some time. So I decided that I would snag myself one and then I would actually snag one for a giveaway that is coming in the fall. A separate giveaway than that other Kokio pen actually. This is for a giveaway that I'm gonna be doing when I host my beginner's fountain pen series in the fall. So I got two of these pens, one for a lucky winner and one for myself. And then I ordered some highlighters and some whiteout. 
So in one of my subscription boxes from Avant Agenda, I got one of these Key Point highlighters in purple, and I absolutely love the highlighter. I love it, and I am really picky about highlighters, and I love these highlighters. One of the things I love about them is I just love how basic and clean they look, but also they feel really good in your hand when you are highlighting, and then the color is really, really pretty as well. So I'm going to turn this over. This one I got is in the gray. This is a cool gray, so it kind of has green undertones to it. And this one is the mint green. These, these highlighters have been discontinued by the manufacturer, so they're not gonna be carried at the shop anymore. So if there are any left and you want one, I would definitely go and snag one now before they sell out. And then that is the mint green. So you can check those out. So those are my new highlighters. And then I got this MG correction tape. I just wanted to try it out. I do have a favorite correction tape that I use a lot, but I liked how slim this was and how it fit nicely in my pouch. And so I decided that I would check that out. And then I got this Kokio Field Notebook. I love Kokio products. And this line of field notebooks actually match the actually match the ME pen. So these go together and they offer these in the different colors that the pen comes in. But it is just a grid notebook. It has a hard exterior. It's very small and compact. You could fit it into your pocket, into your purse, into a planner pouch, wherever you wanted to carry it. You could even slip this into your traveler's notebook. And so I thought I would grab that to go with this pen and this will be part of that giveaway in the fall. This is my freebie that came with my order. So I got this quote card. There are always flowers for those who want to see them. And then I got September and October planner card. And then they have the place down below where you can write important events or tasks for that month. And then on the back, they have some quotes. And the next thing I bought from the shop is their multifunction task insert. So this is a combination of boxes and categorized lists for your planner. And I got this in classic happy planner size, but they do offer different disc bound sizes as well as ring bound planner sizes. But I just really liked the functionality of this insert and decided that I needed it for my social media planner for things that I have planned for my channel. So on the front, it has this categorized list section where you can write down a list and then you have a place to check off what you're doing. So I'll probably use this list for filming and so it has a place for me to write down the list of the videos and then this can be the steps that I take in filming it. So filming it, editing it, scheduling it, making the thumbnails, those kinds of things. And then a place to check off as they've been completed. That way when I film things ahead, I know where they are, I know if they've been posted, I know if I have extra steps that I need to do before I post them, and so that is one side of it. And then the other side, it has this long grid box a little header box and then these smaller boxes that you can do whatever it is that you want with them. So I might use this for video planning as well. I haven't quite figured out how I'm gonna use this insert. When I do, I will try to share that with you guys either in a video here or on Instagram. But I just thought these were very functional. You could use them for school, you could use them for work. There's just a lot of things that you could do with these inserts and you get a bunch of them. I think it's a really good value. That is the SKU and that is the name. So the other two items that I got from the shop in my order, let me scoot all this so I can keep things together. So the other two things I got are a disc bound cover and some tabs. And those are at the bottom of the box. So I'm gonna take those out real quick and then we will check out my surprise box. So I ordered a letter sized matte black disc bound cover. So this is letter size. So literally you can print something out on your printer, punch it with your holes and stick it right in. So I ordered this along with tabs that are black to go with it. And this is actually for recipes. So we have recipes that we use regularly when we were doing meal planning. We actually used to do HelloFresh. And although we canceled our subscription to it because 
it does get expensive but also because the calorie level of a lot of their meals were way too high and we realized that we could take the recipes that we got with those boxes because they come on these roughly letter sized cards we could take those recipes and we could remake them ourselves and we could cut some things out or change out some items and customize them to things that we like better or we could change the calorie content of the items and so one of the things that we wanted to do was to keep all those recipe cards together so that when we're doing meal planning or when we're cooking we can just grab it and we have the recipe and the instructions all right there and with other recipes that we have that aren't things we have memorized that we have to look up we could print those out the ones that we make regularly as a family and we could keep them all together in a little disc bound planner in our kitchen and then that way when it was time to cook or time to make a list for shopping for our meals we could just grab it and use it for that we could also use it for meal planning and so the idea was that we would have a section for each type of protein and the recipes we love for those protein sources that we use most regularly in our meal planning as a family could go behind each of those tabs. So one for chicken and one for pork and one for venison and so on. So that comes with the tabs and then the little labels so that you can label your tabs. And these labels are very cool because they are two-sided. I can pull one off. So if you can see that, you write on both sides and then it folds over the edge of your tabs. That way you have the words on both sides, which I think is really nice. So it comes with a set of labels for your tabs. And so what we're gonna do is we're gonna put this together and make a little recipe book. I have some black plastic discs from the Happy Planner. I think I have them somewhere. Yeah. So these are just solid black discs from the Happy Planner and I have a bunch of these laying around. So I thought we would just make a recipe binder for our kitchen with this stuff. So we have the black cover and we have the tabs and we have the labels and then I already had the discs and now we can set up our little recipe binder. So these are the items that I bought from their shop. I really like the items in their shop. I just really like the aesthetic of Avant Agenda and they are just so sweet and such an awesome shop. So this is what I bought from the shop and now we're gonna check out my surprise box. So here's the surprise box. And I'm just going to grab this and scooch it out of the way. As you guys are probably aware, surprise boxes are grab bag, right? So you don't have any idea what's in them. So some of these items could be items that I've already gotten in past sub boxes, or they could be something that's just not for me. And it, in which case I will probably just gift it to somebody on the channel that might want it. But I thought it would be fun to check it out and see what we get. So this is my surprise box. So I got this acrylic business card holder. I like that. I could use this actually to store oops, all my little planner cards so that when I'm going to decorate my planner, I have them all together in one place. So let's just go ahead and stick those in there. And then I got a pen and a mild liner. So I got this pale pink mild liner, the highlighter end, and then the bullet tip end. And then I got a Shans Color Gel Pen. Let's see where I have a piece of paper right on the back of here. So there's the writing for that. It's sort of a raspberry color. And I got this little envelope that snaps closed that you can use to keep your stickers or your ephemera. I love little pouches and envelopes, especially when they are slim and they are clear. Because then I can stick them in my tote bag or my little phonics planner pouch and I can see what's in them and they don't take up a lot of room, but they keep things organized. Then in here, got some planner cards. This one says, dream and imagine with gold foiling. And it's plain on the back. I'm gonna put these in this little bin. And then this one says, dawn. It's always the darkest before dawn. It has this beautiful watercolor on this pearlescent paper. And then on the back it has a moon with some flowers. And then I got three planner cards. Obviously August has already passed, but this side is less important to me. 
this side is what I love because it has quotes on it so you can use it to decorate the pockets in your planner. You can stick it into your dashboard. You can punch it and put it into your disc bound planner or your ring bound planner, or you can tip it into your bullet journal or your journal. So little planner cards. Then I got two adhesive pockets. I love adhesive pockets. I put them inside my dashboards and my traveler's notebooks so I have a place to stick cards or cash or post-it notes. And these are awesome because they are business card or credit card size. You can see like that, but you could put them on vertically or horizontally. So you could use them either way. So they're really nice if you carry a washi cutting card with you. You can stick your washi cutting card you can stick your washi cutting card in there and then you can adhere this to the inside of your planner or the inside of a dashboard and you'll always have it with you. And I got some beautiful mini washi dot stickers in the clay and gray colorway. Two sheets, the colors are so pretty. And they match the pen that I got. And then I got this beautiful decorative dashboard. I actually got this in a sub box, but it was in mini. So now I have it in classic size. It's on a sort of pearlescent paper and it has this faint leaf pattern on it. It's so pretty and so perfect for fall. And then I got a monthly for July. Obviously this is out of date, but that is not a big deal because you can redate these. I do it all the time. I actually redate all of my Happy Planner monthly inserts because they have a Sunday start, which is what this has as well. But you can also find another month where the first of the month is on Thursday and the last of the month is on Saturday. And the only thing you'd have to do is white out or cover up the Independence Day with a sticker cover this up with a sticker for the month that you're on or a decorative sticker and cover these with washi and decorative stickers and then cover this July here with whatever month it is and you could have this already set up and used it and use it in a future month in 2021 or 2022. So there are lots of ways that you could use this. You could also use this for back planning if you're a person that does memory planning. So if you have been behind on your memory planning, you could put this in your planner and you could go back and you could fill it out with things that happened each day. And then you would have notes about them to memory plan. And then the last thing that I got is awesome because it is dot grid. It is just plain dot grid paper for my classic size happy planner and I use plain paper all the time so I'm really excited about that I probably won't end up using this I could use the front page and just not use the inside but if someone wants this to test out the monthly layout or if they want it so that they can redate it or use it in a month that matches the same date range as July of 2021 just shoot me an email at just scribble.yt at gmail.com and I will mail this out to you Otherwise, I will find some way to use the front page for goals, and then I will probably not use the inside pages for myself. But that is my surprise box. So I got the beautiful dashboard. I got the July monthly insert. I got the dot grid notes inserts. I got the beautiful planner dots, the adhesive pockets, the clear little envelope pouch, the pen, the highlighter, the acrylic business card or planner card holder, and then the planner cards that I shared. So that is in my unboxing of my surprise box from Avant Agenda, as well as my order from their shop. I can bring that over and fit that in the screen. So that is my most recent unboxing from Avant Agenda. Like I said, I do have a discount code that you can use on their subscription boxes, including their pen subscription. So if you wanna take advantage of that, the link will be down below in the description box. Let me know if you have any questions about anything that I unboxed in this video. Make sure you are subscribed so you don't miss future videos and don't forget to just scribble.